Your movie theaters in the Capital Region start to reopen their doors today, welcoming back business, but changes are in place. Jackie Slater joins us live from Colony Center, and she's giving us a bird's eye view as to what those changes are. Hey, Jackie. Jerry, you can't see it, but I'm smiling underneath my mask. The smell of the fresh pop popcorn, that's the first thing we noticed when you walked into the building today. It has been seven months since a movie was screened here and then everything was shut down. So definitely an exciting day for both moviegoers and staff here. Now, some good news on the staff side. Everyone here today are return employees and they are happy to be back at work. Some big changes you'll notice as soon as you walk in. There's hand sanitizer locations scattered throughout the theaters and the lobby areas. Masks are a must for employees and patrons, and there will be staff monitoring to make sure people are following the rules inside the theater. Now, people are allowed to take their masks off when they're eating or drinking. State guidelines right now are no more than 25% capacity and no more than 50 people total per screen. Now, currently, Regal has four newer movies they're screening, as well as some oldie but goodies, and here it looks like they're off to a pretty solid start. We put tickets on sale. We saw a bunch of advanced sales. Um, we have over 100 tickets sold for today, and we're hoping to see that grow over the next few hours. All right, so Jerry, to make you a little jealous here, I'm going to do a show and tell of what you should be doing when you're sitting in the theater, right? You got to keep your mask on, uh, you lower it, you can eat your popcorn and then put your mask back up. So that's how it's done. All right, so uh, movie scattered throughout the day. Check it out, credit cards only for now. Jerry, back to you. All right, Jackie, it's going to take you a long time to eat that whole bag of popcorn there, but uh, I, know, I know you won't give up.